Good day, everyone. My name is Mrs. Olufunke Okuyemi. I want to use this opportunity to congratulate my dear brother, Reverend Bola Arowolo, and uh, my dearest friend, Mrs. Yemi Arowolo, on their 40th wedding anniversary. To God be the glory. I thank God because God granted me the opportunity to witness this relationship right from the beginning, from the get-go, as they say. And um, I'm grateful to God that I'm alive, they are alive, to celebrate this great milestone. By God's grace, uh, I went to University of Ilorin with Sister Yemi, but I knew Brother Bola first because he was in the Polytechnic, uh, not too far from the University of Ilori campus and we had a program called Joint Campus Fellowship between the University, the uh, Quara Polytechnic, College of Education, School of Nursing, those campuses that were around uh, Ilori at the time. We had a Joint Campus Fellowship. That's when I first of all knew uh, Brother Bola, I believe around 1978-79, by God's grace. So that's been quite a few years. A few years later, Sister Yemi got her admission to the University of Ilorin. She was Ola Yemi Adekogba at the time. And uh, we were in fellowship together by God's grace. We became friends, prayer partners. Uh, she would come to our house, my parents' house and I could go to their house. Uh, the, uh, she was staying with the Olofimbo bus at the time. So we thank God for his faithfulness and for his loving kindness. And even when their relationship started, uh, I was privy to it. Uh, long story short, when it was time for them to get married, by God's grace, I was chosen as uh, Sister Yemi's chief bridesmaid. So I was her maid of honor chief bridesmaid so together uh when uh sister yemi was taking brother bola to ikere to meet daddy adekogba and her mom i was the chaperone that went together on the car ride so by god's grace we drove from ilori to ayere we slept in ayere that night if i remember then the following day we went to ikere and uh, brother bola my husband got to meet uh, the father-in-law to be and the mother-in-law to be and a few members of the family but her uncle and auntie in Ilorin, the Olof Imbobas, they had met brother o and were just going to Ikere to introduce him so by God's grace when they got married 40 years ago I was the chief bridesmaid I was with them uh, for the wedding in Ikere by God's grace and um, driven with Brother Bola and Sister Yemi on so many different journeys to Kaduna before they got married as the chaperone followed them there. And uh, uh, when Brother Bola was uh, working in Kaduna and Sister Yemi and I were still in Ilori. So I thank God that um, over the years we've not always lived in the same place or in the same location. But anytime we reconnect, it's as old times. We talk, we chat, we pray, we laugh, and we care for one another. I thank God for your family, your children, your grandchildren, and for how far God has brought you. As you celebrate today, I pray celebration will not cease in your family, that the bond of Christ will continue to bring you, uh, the two of you closer together, and that the mighty hand of God will be great in your ministry. Congratulations, Zoboda. Congratulations, Sister Ola Yemi. We thank God. Glory be to God. Amen. Congratulations and jubilations. You are 40. That's why we're happy. Congratulations and jubilations. You are 40. That's why we're happy. Congratulations and jubilations. You are 40. That's why we're happy. Congratulations, Pastor and Pastor Mrs. Arowolo, on your 40th wedding anniversary. We rejoice with you 
on this important milestone in your marriage. It is a testament to the goodness, the grace and faithfulness of God. We are praising him on your behalf today and praying that he blesses you with many more years together in good health, in joy and prosperity. Again, congratulations. Good afternoon, pastors and misses Aluolo. This is Pastor Abi Jaramala. I'm here to just celebrate with you, to appreciate God on your behalf, for God's faithfulness. 40 years of wedding, of being married, is a great thing, is an awesome thing, and I'm appreciating God for your life. The journey, I'm sure, is packed with so many stories. And I thank God that in that journey, the Lord has allowed me to connect with both of you. I met daddy first and then I met mommy. And now we have become prayer partners. I'm talking about my darling sister. We have become prayer partners. We have become confident. And I appreciate the love for both of you. You have raised what gorgeous and wonderful children. The Lord has blessed you with great grandchildren. The prayer I pray for you today as you celebrate this 40 years of God's faithfulness is that this is just the beginning. You have not seen God yet. In this dispensation where marriage is no longer respected, your marriage will get better and better by the day. It will be sweeter like a sweet wine in Jesus' name. You will not endure marriage. You will continue to enjoy marriage. You will be the example that your children are looking for. In this generation, they will look at your marriage and people will covet to get married. And the work of the assignment the Lord has given to you as a couple, the Lord Almighty will cause both of you to fulfill it in the name of Jesus. The ministry that God has laid in your hands will prosper. God will raise men and women to support you to do this work in the name of Jesus. Mommy, Daddy, my sister, my brother, my friends, you have done well. And the Lord is applauding you today. You will do well to the end in the name of Jesus. I wish I could be here, there with you, but you understand that it's a major, major conflict. Please know that I'm with you in the spirit. And I know that this day, the Lord will glorify himself in your celebration. In Jesus' name, amen. I'm Pastor Tyro Joe. Uh, the Indian pastor was providing food assembly where her money was before she left for America. I want to send a thank God for their marital journey over the years. I want to thank God especially because in thick and thin, the Lord was with them. And we have reason to rejoice with them even at such an occasion as this today. I pray that the Lord who began with them will see them through to the very end gloriously in Jesus' name. Mommy and Daddy, we love you. We wish you many happy return of your anniversary. Uh, my name is Mrs. Sadenike Ojo. Mommy Arolo, generous giver. We want to really appreciate God for your life. That uh, you have done so well. We are, we are seeing mommy and our heart is full of joy. We want to say many more years to you. And the Lord that has kept you will continue to uphold you in Jesus' name. Congratulations. My name is Smart Akonde, the president of the Men Fellowship of Abiding Fruit Assembly, Nigeria. I wish Monia Rolo and uh, my big uncle, Pastor Rolo, a happy wedding anniversary. However, Mrs. Rolo, we miss your disciplinary directions in the church. We wish you are still around to school, some of us. Thank you very much. I'm Ebiola Alali Martins. Um, this is wishing Mommy and Daddy Arolo um, a happy wedding anniversary. Um, the story of mommy and daddy has been that of resilience, determination, and total trust in God. And um, we've been blessed by exemplary leadership, and then um, the church is blessed to have you. God bless you. Amen. Hello, everyone. My name is Adedola for Efogwa. Mommy Alulu, that I know is a generous giver. She can give all our last with joy. And she's somebody I really look up to. She has been good to me and my family. Daddy too, I want to say congratulations. Newness in Jesus' name. Amen. My name is Agnes Ayoyoko. Omiyarubolo, my prayer coordinator. 
daddy always cheerful. Happy wedding anniversary! My name is Clement Onlaya. I just want to wish on your own happy wedding anniversary and uh, Pastor Bola Rolu also happy wedding anniversary. On your own, you have been a wonderful woman, a mentor, a great leader. Uh, I love your courage and your tenacity and uh, you are a true mother. As you are entering into a new season of your marriage, I wish you more blessings, more greater things ahead, both spiritually, physically, and in the world. On behalf of Abadim Food Assembly of the Redeem Christ of God, Abuja, Nigeria, we wish Mommy and Daddy a role of anniversary. Well, I want to say I'm deeply happy for what God has been doing in our lives and that for over 40 years that we've come to know ourselves, God has been very, very faithful. And it's really, really awesome to also know that um, we are celebrating with you your 40th marriage uh, of God bringing you together as husband and wife. And we thank God because the Lord has been faithful. And it is this faithfulness that we are all celebrating today. It's really, really awesome. On behalf of my wife, my siblings, because you know them and they know you, our children and grandchildren of the same family we want to say a big congratulations for being alive to be part of this celebration. The Almighty God who has brought you this far will keep you to fulfill your full lifespan. None of you will die before your time. The Almighty God will keep you. And as it keeps you, we are looking forward to when you will be celebrating your golden jubilee. That's 50 years of wedding. And we believe that um, with God all things are possible. We had the privilege of celebrating this with a quite number of people. And uh, we believe that God we surely do the same for us. We do the same for you. As you look up to him, he will perfect all that concerns you. As you walk at imparting the lives of people across the, the, the whole world, what you've been doing will continue to speak for you. We give God praise. For everything he has done and is doing. We say, to God be all the glory for the things he has done. Congratulations once again. God bless you. I am Reverend Dr. Mrs. Doi Oyelowo from Lagos, Nigeria. I'm glad to be part of this glorious celebration and I want to congratulate my dear, my beloved brother and sister for the 40 years wedding anniversary, it is no joke. It can only be God. Because I remember it was last year, my husband and I clocked 40 years in marriage. And uh, when you do that, it is God. So I want to thank God for being for the journey so far. It's a big congratulation and give all the glory to God. I got to know uh, Reverend Bola and Sister Yemi. Uh, we, we used to call ourselves brother and sister because we have known each other as far back as almost 46 years ago in the school, in the joint fellowship at Siloring. So that was what you, we call ourselves. I call him Brother Bola, we call her Sister Yemi. And we're the same fellowship, we, we belong to the same group called the Flecked Family, where we used to sing together. 
And we're doing that great. We are doing it really uh, great then. And God was helping us to reach out to lives, to go to schools, to churches, to minister to people. And uh, God decided to bring us together again some few years ago. So we had a reunion. And that has continued from that time to now. So I want to really thank God for rekindling the fellowship, rekindling the fire in us. I want to thank the Lord for your life, for your marriage. And I really want to wish you a very, a, I want to pray for more new wine into your marriage, a blissful marriage, a successful marriage, and the, the beauty and the glory of God that has been upon your marriage will continue. The kingdom comes in Jesus' name. I want to wish you long life and prosperity. And God grant all your heart desires in the name of Jesus. I want to congratulate all the children, the grandchildren for being they are part of this celebration. It's a great thing that God is doing. So, my dear brother, my sister, congratulations. I say congratulations again and have a wonderful celebration. I cannot but mention this. I remember sometimes this year, my brother, my, my, my immediate senior brother was in California, fell very ill. And uh, I was so much concerned about his salvation. It was Dr. In Kashiro, based in California, a, a medical doctor by excellence, and I was so much concerned about his salvation. And then, yeah, yeah, I in Nigeria, in California, when I got about this news of his sickness, I had to call on my brother, uh, uh, Bola, to please ensure that he find a way of seeing him, minister to him, and uh, do whatever he could do. And to the glory of God, he took it so seriously with the wife and they jointly ensured that they saw him through particularly at those dark moments in his life the minister salvation to him my brother god's born, born again god saved and god wanted to bring him home at that time it pleases the lord to bring him home and it was a glorious transition so i want to thank you once again brother Abola, sister yemi for god using you for making yourself available to god to use you for my my brother and it's only God that can reward you. It's not, there's nothing anybody can do to reward for this great work. I would say God is not unrighteous to forget our works and labor of which we are shown towards his name. And I pray the good Lord will reward you. Once again, I want to thank you so much for this uh, love of God in you. Have a wonderful celebration. Thank you. <laughs>